sorry, I didn't see you there. Um, welcome to Waylanders Wandering. Do you find yourself shaking your arm off when your paints separate like this? Are you sick of shaking your arm off? Is it time to invest in a vortex shaker? Is it in fact time to reap the whirlwind? Let's find out together. Most of us in wargaming have spent many an hour taking a paint pot and shaking it until your arm comes off just to get the paint mixed to a state where we can actually use it. Is this something that we want to do? No. Is this something that we have to do because the paints are the way they are? Well, frankly, yes. So the question is today, do you need a vortex mixer? Do you find that you're wasting hours of valuable hobby time shaking your paints up just to get some pigment on a miniature? If the answer is yes, let's have a look at the vortex mixer I bought. Before splashing out of my vortex mixer, I did what we all do. I did some research. And by research, I mean I watched some videos by other YouTubers. This is the one that I saw that seemed to do the job that I want. And it was the one that was recommended by the inestimable faux hammer. So thank you for your video, dude. This vortex mixer will take a paint pot that looks like this and turn it into that in the amount of time that you've just seen. Now this one is quite heavy, it is a chunky boy, but what I will add that I don't think that Fohammer mentioned in his video is you would want to add at least a couple of these stainless steel ball bearings to each of your pots of paint. I've added it to all of mine as you can hear with the rattle when I shake them. So you take your paint, push it into the top, this switches the vortex mixer on, little whirly thing lives in there, wakes up, shakes your bottle and as you can see, perfectly mixed paint every time. Quite frankly, with the amount of painting that I've got to do, and honestly the time that I sit between projects where the paint gets to settle, it is definitely worth getting on because I don't want to shake my arms off. I'll leave affiliate links to this, which is a mid-priced Vortex mixer, and very sturdy and has stood me very well so far and some low, uh, low priced and uh, higher priced ones in the description down below so you can choose for yourself if you want to get one and I'll get a tiny little kickback from Amazon if you do choose to get one I like this one this is a mid price can't recommend it enough thank you for watching I hope you found this informative I've been Waylander, you've been fantastic, I love your faces, goodbye.